Hi bestie, uh, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I hope you do good because I'm doing pretty good. I don't know, I always feel pretty pretty good when I start this vlog. I'm already in my Christmas preparations actually. I'm planning lots of gifts this week and hooked sent me some supplies and I wanted to show you guys actually what they sent me. So we're gonna unpackage this together. So that's the package. I have no clue what they sent me actually. They just said, check your mail. We've sent you some Christmas um, crochet projects. So let's see. How cute. Oh, they sent me some new yarn actually. These are like new products, but they also said that they sent me... Oh, that's what they sent me. They sent me a freaking Santa and a penguin. It's called Coco. Oh, and they sent me something else. And a cushion. Looks cool. That's how it looks like. Very comfy. But yeah, these two Christmas crochet projects, thank you Hope. by the way, <laughs> I really appreciate um, those gifts and I can't wait actually to try them out. just coming back from my eye doctor appointment because I have like a yearly checkup because of my diabetes. This doctor is always giving me like eye drops which enlarge my pupils and like after I feel like completely blind. This makes your vision a bit blurry on short distance and you kind of feel very insecure in your public and daily life because your eyesight is not that sharp as it usually is because of the drops and the effect of the drops will loosen its effect actually after a while like three to four hours but in these kind of three to four hours you kind of feel very insecure in your daily life i wanted to shop some christmas gifts actually but like due to my almost blind eyesight i didn't get any of my presents the only thing i got are christmas cards it's like the first time i'm ever giving christmas cards to my presents which is kind of something i've never done it's really cool though <laughs> But this one turned out pretty good. So basically what I did is I just followed the pattern. As you can see, the pattern shows like little V's all over. These little V's. And I just embroidered those little V's using a stencil, of course. So I cut out a stencil, which is this one, marked it with chalk. And then I just embroidered the outline. I have like the feeling this could be a cool gift, personalizing someone's sweater. And for this I'm using a wool needle. They have like a bigger hole as well. That's like easy to work with. And I'm using crocheting yarn, of course, and not embroidery thread. And by the way, I also embroidered little hearts on the sleeve, which kind of look like clouds. 
but I don't care. <laughs> I got the idea to show you a little gift guide, like last minute gift guides about DIY, like DIYing stuff. I already showed you the cardigan, which is a pretty cool idea. I have like the feeling. What else is a pretty cool gift? It's a crocheted plant cover. I shot this in one of my videos. I'm gonna tag it. This is pretty fast and if you have some leftover yarn, this is like the perfect gift actually. You just have to buy a plant, a cool looking pot and then you crochet a cover for it. What else to gift? Actually, which is a pretty cool idea. To crochet a little bookmark. And I have a tutorial about this on my Pinterest. It's like a cool gift to give with a book and you can do this in different colors and it's pretty fast and super easy actually, so. Okay, next one is a little bit bigger but it's very, very simple and very, very easy. So it's this picture. As you can see, there's nothing on it but if you look closer, it's about the pattern. You wanna see it? And what I really like about this picture, actually I'm gifting this to my sister. I have a feeling she doesn't watch my YouTube, so. I've done a video about this already. I really love the idea because it's not like something, like it's so simple that everybody kind of likes it. It's not too much. It's kind of artsy with a pattern and it looks so simple and clean that everybody wants to hang it up. You can also do this in different colors if you want to, but I decided to go only for white. You can work like with different beige tones and stuff like that. So I'm using actually the structure paste, which is called medium, acrylic medium. It's used for acrylic paintings you can actually uh, buy this in every craft so store or hardware store that's pretty easy and you use this with a spatula and you can draw something quite cool like this which is also a kind of cool gift my last gift idea for you guys DIY gift idea actually is notebook embroidery which looks like this I bought a notebook which is a simple notebook with a paper cover. Well, actually this has more like a leather look. I printed out my embroidery design, which is a cross stitch design. I poked with a needle through my design in order to build my four holes for making a cross stitch. You see that? Each cross is connected by four holes and then you connect those holes with your embroidery floss by simply embroidering it. I'm gonna tag the design in the link below. Maybe I'm gonna give this to somebody. I mean, not this one, but maybe I'm gonna redo this. on apparently some part of the body I think it's the head and I've never done origami is it origami origumi that's like the very first time that I'm trying this out it's pretty exciting but it's also kind of complicated you have to count a lot and I hate counting on stitches I hate it <laughs> like the second one I've already finished the first one oh, it's so cute oh my god so this is the first the very very first time I'm doing a amigurumi is it called like this amigurumi so this is the very first time I'm doing an amigurumi and I kind of like it it's so fun it's like building something out of crocheting the little arm I have to weave in the axis and attach it to the body.
I like it. It's so cute with this little hat. Okay, I can fully recommend this kit. Thank you, Hooked, again, for sending me these. My very first Ari, Arigumi? Arigu, Arigurumi? Arigurumi? This name is killing me. Isn't this cute? I just wanted to show you the final result of my little Santa, like at daylight, because the other day it was almost dark already. Bestie, I hope you liked this little vlog. Feel free to give it some thumbs up, and if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, feel free to subscribe for more DIY videos in the future. And yeah, I can't wait to be back in the next video vlog. Thanks for watching. I hope you have a good day, good morning, a good evening whenever you're watching this video. And I can't wait to be back in the next vlog video. I see you soon. Bye-bye. I'm out.